Well, this morning, smoke and flames were seen for miles right near South San Francisco. Three boats caught fire out at Oyster Point just after 7 o'clock. Firefighters had to act quickly as witnesses say they saw several people jumping right into the water. KTVU's Brooks DeRose spoke to those witnesses who described the chaotic event. I saw the flames, I saw the fires, I heard the ambulances. Frantic moments in South San Francisco. Fierce flames and thick black smoke, not on land, but on the water. The flames seemed to be maybe 20, 30 feet in the air. It was blazing when I got here. Our department received numerous calls for multiple boats on fire in the vicinity of the Oyster Cove Marina, which is just adjacent here to Oyster Point Marina in between us and the city of Brisbane. Just before 7.30 Wednesday morning, three boats tied together quickly caught fire, flaring up and floating apart. Those who work near Oyster Point say the surprises kept coming. And that's when we saw an explosion that had happened. I'm assuming the propane tanks burst. Um, and we saw people jumping into the water. Witnesses say several people live aboard the boats, which are often anchored in the harbor. I didn't see the people in the water. I just heard a lot of screaming. But Ashley Palayo saw it all and says she called 911, telling first responders people may be in trouble. We saw that there was a gentleman still hanging onto the boat, and we're like yelling at him to move out of the way, get off of the boat, but he wasn't, he couldn't swim. Within minutes, South San Francisco Fire Department arrived. Backup from San Mateo Harbor Patrol, Redwood City Fire, and the U.S. Coast Guard also moved in to make rescues. They were very happy to be out of the water, very happy to be safe. Only one person was taken to a hospital with minor injuries. All three boats were destroyed. Firefighters spent hours trying to clean up what's left behind, deploying oil booms to gather the debris. We're in tidal water and waters will move. We don't want any of the movement to take any contaminants out into the bay. There's concern for the ecosystem, but also for those who unexpectedly lost their boats. But what sparked it all is not yet known. Pretty scary. I can only imagine how the folks on the boat felt. If I was stressed out and scared, I'm sure that they were even more scared and stressed. South San Francisco Fire Department is investigating the cause of this fire. It's still unclear on which boat it started and exactly where. At Oyster Point, Brooks Jabros, KTVU Fox 2 News.